Hey guys, welcome back to Vitamin Y. So today is Saturday, and that means we are using Ubel and Zectors. So, I believe last week the deck didn't go so hot, I ended up losing some duels, but you know, I still I still believe that this deck can do fairly well. I don't want to give it up. Nope. You know, so I mean it does have synergy, and of course this deck got a new upgrade with Soul Charge, which of course I refuse to play. So you don't have to worry about me, you know, even picking up that card, because I'm not. I do not like Soul Charge. And this hand's Part good, part bad. I mean, I opened up with Hornet and, S and Centipede, so that's good. Uh, now it's not good, because I can't even destroy the freaking Mega Phantom Beast. Yep. So I'll go ahead and just... Yeah, I'll go ahead and just... Summon Centipede and search. No more summon? Okay. Yep. So I'll just equip on equip, pop one of this back row. Ah, uh, the one deck where I can't pop the monster. Because <laughs> the damn, to the damn effect token. Ah! So I'll go ahead and get my effect on. Because I can equip from, from my hand or graveyard. So I can. So I'll go ahead and equip. And I'll get my E. Oh, you want to read it? Sure. Go ahead. Effects. Now I said go ahead and search for a uh, dragonfly. It was just called hunted. And uh where are you, dragonfly? There you are. The good thing is I got the limit reverse, so if I need to I can always just go limit reverse, summon dragonfly. So I can summon back dragonfly from the graveyard and it won't even cost me my normal summon? That's so powerful. Nice and powerful. So he only gets a token when he's summoned, right? So far, it doesn't really seem like there's any back row to affect me, so... Depending on what he does next turn, I might just, when he attacks, I might just lance him. Might be the most, mo more optimal play. What's this card do? Once per turn, you can special someone. No, no, no. Turn your end phase is trippy. One, no, no, no. What's this card? Okay. So you're gonna summon the... Token? I did hit the wrong card. Definitely. Mm-hmm. So you're gonna make... Yeah, that's fine. So you're gonna make a Draco Smack? Go ahead, make a Draco Smack. Yep. Draco Smack! That was obvious. How the hell am I supposed to handle Draco Sack? Oh my god, this is like the freaking worst duel ever. Why are you targeting my card? Why are you targeting my card? If you want to use your effect, you're going to have to give me one of your tokens, please. No, give me one of your tokens. Give me one of your tokens. You want to use Draco Sack Effect? Give me one of your tokens. Come on. Get rid of it. One of them. Destroy one of your tokens. Destroy one of your tokens. Get rid of one of your tokens. Draco Sack. Okay, there we go. I'll go ahead and chain. Not that you can't attack anyway, but sure. So you left my freaking centipede alive. That that wasn't the smartest. That wasn't the wisest decision. You could you should have killed my centipede. Definitely should have killed my centipede. <laughs> sure. Sure. You want a dark hole? Sure. Get rid of your tokens. Tokens are gone though. Draco Sack would have been safe in, despite the lance, but the tokens are definitely gone. So what are you going to do with Aerial Recharge during your end phase? Get rid of it? That's fine. It's totally fine. It's totally fine indeed. 
I'm gonna dragonfly. Okay. That wasn't that wasn't a smart play. I guess you were afraid of the back row, but that wasn't a smart play. I'll go ahead and go effect. Go ahead and equip this. E oh, I must have in way too many F's. Effects. Get rid of your back row. I will go ahead and summon a ch 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 the beat. He will get his effect. He will go ahead and also equip the hornet. Effects. Unequip the hornet and pop. But think about if I had a freaking soul charge and all these in the graveyard. That would be ridiculous. Like this 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 deck is this could be stupid with soul charge. I will go ahead and equip to Dragonfly. Dragonfly 2400. Centipede attack. Dragonfly attack. There goes half your life points. Bah! Go ahead, sir. Oh, are you down on resources? <laughs> oh, and you already used your Dark Hole because you're an idiot. So unless you got some kind of Trigger Gores or something, that's game. 16. Twenty-four. Yep, you used up way too much resources, and that wasn't a smart play. You you shouldn't have dark hold. You shouldn't have dark hold. That's that's where you fuck. Uh, where you fucked up is that you didn't take out my centipede. Because even if you didn't dark hold, I could have just went okay. Centipede equip unequip pop one of the tokens. Dragonfly equip unequip pop the other token. Summon that whatever monster would probably be centipede equip unequip pop your Draco sack. So you, you should have took out the centipede. If you wouldn't have took out, if you took out the centipede, I wouldn't have got that extra attack. But yeah, whatever. I mean, even when I lanced you, you were still strong to me. You were 18, so that's where he definitely fucked up. So what you gonna do? You can't hold everybody's hand in game Yu-Gi-Oh. I mean, for goodness sakes, he 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 was just afraid of the back row, and it cost him the duel. Ah, uh, paper. Damn, I should have went rock. I was thinking rock, but I was like, yeah, no. Uh, oh well. And the sand is terrible. Where is Dark Greffer or Armageddon Knight when you need them? I have not seen them in a cool minute. They where are my my Dark Warrior homies? All right, go ahead, sir. Wow, that's ironic. And why would you even summon him without even equipping? And I still drawn the shit. Are you shitting me? I'm gonna lose against a fucking deck, a fucking mirror match because I'm not drawing shit. Come on. Are you shitting me? The guy even summoned centipede too. Like, why would you do that? You shouldn't just summon centipede without equipping or something. Then he could get killed by one of my monsters. I mean, he has a 16 beater, but still, that's risky. Okay. You could attack me anyway. So, was he 26? Is that when he's unequipped? Is that really how it works? I don't think that's how it works. You can equip an open equip card, you can instead of the river. Uh this says nothing about an equip. You can once per turn you can equip an answer bunch of this card is Equipped monster. You can send this card to the graveyard to equip. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave. So you unequip him to attack directly. I guess. And yeah, my hand was just way too shitty. That's not a surprise, though. I've been getting shitty hands a lot lately, but. Couldn't face him like that. Especially since he just got Hornet. It's gonna be over anyway. 
You too. You shouldn't be in my hand. <laughs> it's kind of like the opposite. But whatever. It's fine, I guess. What, you got a shitty hand too? Polly. Oh shit. Oh shit, Endragon. Opened up with all three of them, damn. So you can take a page, Runny. Uh, damn, you saw that? I'll go ahead and summon Centipede. Is that okay? Seriously. That's luck. To open up with all three pieces in your hand. So, you get lucky. I don't. You get lucky. I mean, uh, you know, we definitely realize in this game that there's there's a factor of luck. In any card game, there's a factor of luck. Puppy and Dragoon. I need to get rid of them eventually. And I'll go ahead and so while this card is sent to the graveyard, while equipped to a monster, you can target one extra monster in your graveyard. Except this guy's supposed to summon it. And this is the original attack, right? No, equal to its attack. Oh. Okay, that's fine. I'll go ahead and foolish. Of course I know. It's not that hard to know what that fucker does. I'm gonna equip the Gigamantis, and then when he kills my centipede, the Gigamantis will go, and then I can target another one in my graveyard, which will be the other centipede. 24. He's 24. Uh, go ahead. He can come right back, okay. And a 60 card in Dragoon deck too, and he opened up like that. Wow, wow, Renny, take a take a page from this guy right here. He can play a 60 card in Dragoon deck and fucking <coughs> and fucking still pull that shit off. You don't want to bring him back? Fine, don't bring him back. Isn't during your your next demo phase? No, you can just bring it back whenever. Yeah, during your stamp of it, discard during your grave, are you conventional? Yeah. All the hornets. All the hornets. What the fuck are you talking about? Hornet is the fucking shit. Like, you better fucking recognize. Effect. Go ahead, equip. Effects. Unequip, pop. I will go ahead and search me for another. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, then I will go ahead and summon Centipede. Effect. Unequip. Effects. Unequip. Pop. This deck is still stupid. Especially with Soul Charge. Like, it's gonna be super retarded with Soul Charge. And I guess I'll go ahead and get me an... I don't know. Shit. Yeah, I guess I'll get, just get me a Hopper. Destroy this for me. The fuck is that? Oh, okay, I guess. Why don't you just run Mirror Force? I 
There goes a huge chunk of your life points, and I'll pass to you. So go ahead. Go ahead and be cute. Go ahead and summon your end dragon back. I will just pop him and then go for the game. Go for the game. I like how I said that. Tell me two pace on the hill. Have the attack of one if you do lose the attack. Add the attack of the last one to the other. Okay, so. Add the attack, so 24, so that's 12. So I lose 12 and you gain 12. That's fun. So first I take the damage, so I was 12 and you are 24. So I take your monster's attack. And then I'll go ahead and get Giga Effect. I think I'm doing this right. I think you can do this. If I'm wrong, go ahead and correct me. But I believe that he was, you know. Well, this card is sent to a while well, equipped to a monster. No, because the monster will go first. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That's not how that works. If, it was there, if that's how it worked, then everybody would be playing multiple Gigamancers. That's not how it works. That's not how that works. <laughs> that's fine, though. So that's a game. So I'm going to go ahead and just go... Senti effect. Once again... You don't want any more horn Hornet, I'm sorry, but I can Hornet loves you. Hornet loves you. Or at least it's gonna beat the shit out of you just by just popping your shit. I do not know why you never bought Ender Dragoon back with your shitty ass deck. Sixty card deck and still opened up with Ender Dragoon, that's good. But then you never brought him back. I don't know why. Kinda just left him in the grave. He's like, you know, you come back, right? I'm like, yeah. And then he never brings him back. I'm like, okay. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I guess. Not really. I thought you were gonna do something with that end dragoon, but you didn't. Alright guys, I'm gonna go ahead and call an episode. So sorry you guys didn't get to see any you bell plays, but hey, when there's you bell plays, I'll do them, but sometimes there isn't. <laughs> so Thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with the, the new deck. Yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow with the new Yubel deck. So tomorrow you actually get a double at the usual time that Vitamin Y goes up, I believe, 12, I want to say? Yeah, 12. Um, you will get a deck profile of a battling box for Yubel, and then at 1.30 you guys will get... Um, the actual episode of Vitamin Y using the new deck. So, thank you guys for watching, thank you guys for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.